Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can make adjustments to the height of columns and the width of rows using the mouse. To do this, place your mouse pointer over the border of the column or row to adjust until the mouse pointer turns into a double line with an intersecting arrow, and then click and drag to adjust the column width or row height. In addition to manual adjustments that you make with your mouse, you can also use the commands in the Cell Size button group in the Layout tab to set the size of the columns and rows in your table. You can do this by first selecting the cells whose width or height you wish to adjust. Then use the height and width spinner boxes to set the height and width of the selected cells. You can also use the Auto Fit button to apply automatic adjustments to selected cells. To do this, first select the cells that you want to automatically adjust. Then click the Auto Fit button in the Cell Size button group in the Layout tab. Then select the method of adjustment to apply Auto Fit Contents which will resize the cells to fit their content, auto fit window, which will stretch the table across the page to fit the window, or fixed column width, which allows you to set the width of the columns by hand using the te techniques we just learned. Another way to adjust row height or column width is to equally distribute the spacing allocated to a selection of rows or columns. For example, if you had three adjacent columns of unequal sizes in a table, you could select them and then resize them so that each one was the same width over the selected area. To do this, select the columns or rows to evenly distribute. Then click the Distribute Rows or Distribute Columns button in the Cell Size button group. This will distribute the selected columns or rows equally over the selected area. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.